Welcome to Whiskey Wednesday. My name is Dean, and this is Eno E. Whiskey Whiskey. Welcome. Today I'm going to taste for you Jim Beam White Label. This is distilled through Jim Beam Distilleries out of Claremont, Kentucky. 40% alcohol by volume, 80 proof. Mash bill is 77% corn, 13% rye, 10% malted barley. Everything I've read about this and I've tasted it several times is, is it's not an offensive style of bourbon. It's very mellow, low price point, so it makes it you know affordable for anybody to buy. Solid bourbon for all the different levels of bourbon tastes. If you happen to be somebody more sophisticated and like some of the really complex bourbons, this will be just fine for you. If you like to have more of a simple style of flavors, this one will do for you also. So let's take a peek here. Coloration is a nice light gold. Very pretty. Somewhere around probably the four to five year range for this. Not a whole lot of windows will begin in the form, so this tells me it should be a little more in the silkier. Okay, they'll be in the form, so it might be silky. We'll find out here in a second. Let's do the nose first. Lots of corn, light fruit, some caramel, vanilla, which typically you're going to get out of almost any bourbon, the caramels and vanillas, because of the fact that that's what comes from the wood. So anytime you, you notice those type of flavors are consistently, or scents are consistently there as well as for flavors of vanilla and caramel, it's, that's from the wood after they've charred it. Very nice. Let's take a taste. Caramel, vanilla, fruit, honey. That's very nice. Medium length finish to it, nothing really long or obtrusive, just nice medium finish. And based on the windows, that's what it should have gotten. There's a few windows, but not a whole lot, which should have put it right in the medium range, which is what it did. If you like what we're doing here at ENOE, please hit the like and subscribe button down at the bottom of the page. And also check out our Instagram. Every Wednesday morning we do post a picture of the bourbon we'll be tasting that day or scotch or whiskey. With that being said, the best scotch, bourbon, or whiskey that is out there is the one that you like to drink the way you like to drink it. If you prefer to have it on the rocks, if you prefer to have it with a splash of water, straight, or neat, or with a little bit of soda, that's your preference. And that makes that, makes that whiskey, bourbon, or scotch the best for you. With that being said, I hope you all have a fantastic weekend, and cheers.